here, um, assuming that Shinikachi keeps stage control, he will be able to do very well. But with tether grabs and all this offstage play, I believe I'm up from Mars. Assuming that his game plan is throw you offstage and keep you offstage is actually going to give Shinya a real hard time. So we just have to wait and see what the game plans are going to be. A couple of near there's on his landing. He's trying to get the jabs out of shield, but unfortunately unable to do so. There's the back air to the up tilt. Another up tilt coming out. Not really going to do it just yet. Could have went for a full hop nair. Actually took advantage of all that damage he can put out. Oop. Another back air into the down tilt to grab. Not really going to do it just yet. Shine now with all the stage control in the world. There's the nair to forward air. So much damage coming out from this character. This forward tilt not going to get it just yet. Misspaced it. There's the Nair there trying to cross him up, but she ain't ready for it. Nope. Peek and fire? Nope, not going to do it just yet. There's another Nair. Going to just wait for an option to be thrown out in case he has to punish it. Nope, forward tilt. Not just yet. PK Fire just trying to get him off the ledge. She ain't wanted to get the trump, but there it is. Just calling out the neutral getup. Now she get the forward tilt, and that's going to take the first stock. So now Muffin Mars. Probably can start looking into changing his game plan just a little bit. Oh. If I, there's the thunder. Not really going to do it. Oh, and he falls out of it. Potential STI? Question mark? I'll have to take a look at that later. A couple of nares. Forward air. Thought he was going to roll in. Try to go for the forward smash. Oh, PK freeze, unfortunate. I believe he was probably going for something else and just as Nelly misinputted. Getting a little bit too antsy here. They're near to forward air again coming out for Sheena. Oh, another Zare. Calling out the landing option. No, not gonna do it. Oh, both of these players just pairing. It's good to see that the, these players are getting used to it. There's a great punish with Perry. Thunder now. Oh my goodness. The tail actually bringing him into the hitbox. And he's actually going to get the kill with it. Oh, down throw to Forder. Oh, great tech roll in. Couple of jams to forward tilt. Down to into the jabs as there's now another Nair. Oh, more parries coming off of these Nair Sheena. Now has to start watching out for that. But you see him off of you see him off of Mars' cable of when he gets a good parry going. Dun, dun, nope. Forward air to Oh, there it is. Sheena with the back air. 28% here on his second stock. Looking like a pretty healthy lead. Please don't make me eat my words again. Okay, thank goodness. <laughs> oh, Couple resets there with the jab. Just going to decide to go for the full jabs instead of uh, getting a better punish out of it. Down throw to upper. That's going to get it. A couple zares there into the forward air. Still able to chase him down. Not showing any hesitation. PK fire. No jump here. Nope. Sign to keep it. Trying to, sign to play it safe. Oh, my legs. My legs. Oh, my legs. Okay. Sometimes you just gotta stretch your legs mid set. Ow, sorry guys. Ooh, forward throw? Yep. Quick draw onto the stage. No, quick draw into the middle of the stage. And there's another PK fire. Still not gonna be enough. Ooh, lands on the platform. Great stuff there from Shine. Another Nair. Another Nair. Into the up air. Another Nair on the landing there. Just got a little bit too antsy and just decided to roll away. Oh, there's the roll. Oh, mistimes it. 131%. He knows what he's capable of. He can get the good, he can get a good gimp going as long as he gets brave off stage. Down to the forward, down to the forward tilt. Interesting. 
There's another Nair trying to get the PK fire. Thought he was going to fast fall out of it. 61% here on Shine. There's another, there's another forward tilt trying to get the down tilt here. The great spacing here from Shine. There's the back throw. PK fire going to try and call out the quick draw. Oh, oh. Oh, spot dodge, great read there from Muffin from Mars. There's the Nair out, there's the Nair out of shield. Oh, and the forward smash calling out the air dodge into the stage, and Muffin from Mars with the clutchest stock I've seen in a while. Great stuff from Muffin. Woo! <laughs> Mars taking that forward smash, taking a huge sigh of relief. Drew, even I had to take a sip. No, Shine. Sitting back a little bit. Potentially a little discouraged at that pick. He was doing really well, getting his conversions. Actually getting a lot of very interesting conversions. Hovering over K rule for a second there. Yikes. A little bit scary. Thinking about his potential choices. Okay, deciding to go with Ike. Staying somewhat confident with this choice, he did turn over to Muffin and give him a little bit of a smirk. So maybe, uh, maybe just a little bit of a reassurance there. Kind of throwing him off or maybe even stalling just for the sake of momentum. Look, there's another forward tilt. Ooh, up air, calling out the landing option. Couple of forward airs. There's the Nair trying to cross him up a little bit, but actually could have been a potential mix up here. There's the Nair trying to get another Nair out of it, unable to do so. PK Fire got to come into play. There's the Nair. There's another Nair with the platform assist, unable to actually get anything more out of it. There's the Nair into the back air, not really going to do it just yet. Another up air there through the platform, still not able to do it. Dash attack. Trying to break through this bubble that Muffin from Mars is trying to create. That was a very interesting uh, call there on the Zare as the up tilt actually picking him up from the platform drop. Scooped him. If I had to fire. Another forwarder. Oh, there's the up B. Still not going to be enough, even if even at that percentage. But the forwarder is definitely going to do it. But 83% there on his second stock. This is starting to look pretty scary here. Down throw up air. Not really going to do it. Decide not to DI um, away from him. Shane was fully prepared for the DI away. Oh, there it is. Nair to up air, and that is going to take it. 35% here on Sheena's second stock. Muffin from Mars is going to need another clutch. Actually, Muffin from Mars is going to need two clutch stocks in order to stay alive. Not even stay alive. In order to end this set. Down throw. Up air. Up air again. Oh, that was scary. Couple Zares there, just trying to tack on a little bit more damage. Down throw to up air. No, not going to do it. Is this the forward tilt on the landing option? That hitbox was at his head, and it still gets him. That makes no sense. It just works. Awkward hitboxes. That's all I have to say about that. <laughs> I 
Now she locked into the Ike after that win. All right, so here we go. Game three, our very first game three. This is winner's quarters. This isn't winner's semis. Winner's semis is when the best of fives begin, and most likely where I will be out because I'll be exhausted. Now, game three, town and city, definitely a very good choice here from Muffin from Mars. A little bit more space to run around as you keep that mid-range. Couple nares into the fair. Thunder gonna come into play. Miss spaces it just a little bit as there is the nair to up tilt, tacking on just a little bit more damage. Another couple of nairs able to actually jump out. There's the down tilt to fair. Down throw, up air. Oh my goodness. A little bit of awkward DI there. There's the backer onto his shield. Still not really going to get enough. Down tilt to forward tilt. Is that you're going to do it, but pressing a little bit too many buttons. And Sheena actually taking full advantage of that into the nair, into the up air, and that's going to take the stock. From Mars, one minute into this game, is already down a stock. Into the dash attack. Tacking on just a little bit more. Ooh, quick draw. Actually, gonna go straight through that PK Thunder. 131%, 76 here on, on Muffin from Mars. There's the forward air. The forward air definitely going to do it. Such a strong move in Lucas's arsenal. Ooh, oh, oh, oh. There's the Nair. Ooh, the up the out of shield. PK Fire, trying to get the chase out of it. Not really going to do it. Designed to rest on the platform. It gets backered for his trouble. Muffin from Mars taking a big breath. Kind of turning his head a little bit. Maybe didn't really agree with that. Maybe wanted to actually drop through the platform. You know, hindsight is 20-20. So, have to keep it moving. 37% already on his second stock. Down tilt to down tilt to up air. Tack on just a little bit more. I say tack on a lot. I'm sorry. There. Ooh! Actually able to contend with an upper of his own. There. Back air. PK Fire calling out the quick jump, but unable to actually take full advantage of that. 82% here, and he's 82% on his final stock here in winner's side. Shine with 127%, and he still has another stock to spare. There, up air, able to air dodge away. Ooh, PK fire. Able to maintain a little bit of stage control. Sheena actually able to nair and get the upper out of it, and that's going to do it. Sheena with a somewhat commanding game three. Taking full advantage of the fact that Mother from Mars was throwing out a lot of options just a little bit too early. And was able to perfectly time a nair into whatever his imagination can make up. And that is going to do it. Sheena, moving on, winner side.